In this video, I'm going to be going over how to add news ticker in WordPress step by step. Adding a news ticker in WordPress is a quick and easy process. By the end of this video, you will successfully have a news ticker added to your WordPress site. Let's get started. To start, I'm in the WordPress dashboard. Hover over the plugins tab in the left side menu. Click add new plugin. In the search box, type in Diddy. You'll see the Diddy plugin showing here. Click the install now button. Once it is done installing, click the activate button. Once it is done activating the plugin, you'll be on the plugins page. Next, click the dashboard tab in the left side menu. Next, find Diddy and hover over it. Click add new. You'll now see options you can choose through. I'm going to keep the default selected. Click the add default button. You'll see the text here. You can replace this and put anything you'd like. I'll put in breaking news update. This is how to add news ticker in WordPress. Under link, you can input a link if you want the text to link to somewhere. For example, I'll put in a link as an example. You'll see the text showing with the link. You can add a link title if you'd like. For example, I'll make mine click here. If I hover over the text, you'll see the click here title show. You can make the link no follow if you'd like. I'm going to remove the link and link title as I don't want any for mine. Click the update item settings button when you are done. If you click add item, you can add another news ticker. If you click the edit icon, you can make edits to the news ticker. Next, click this icon here. You want to select ticker. Click the update type button. You'll see the news ticker showing here. If you need to change this, click change type next to it. You can select the ticker from here or change how you'd like. You can select the direction you want the news ticker, the spacing, and speed. There's some more settings you can adjust if needed below. If you click styles, you can change the font, font weight, size. You can change the item text color, link color, and background color if you'd like along with border settings. If you click title, you can make changes to how the title shows. Click the save Diddy button when you are done. If you click the settings icon, you can change the title. Where you see status, you can choose to disable it and make it active here. You can choose to do live updates. You can change the preview background color if you'd like. I'll copy the short code here so we can add it to our website. Make sure you've saved your changes. Next, pull up a post or page that you want to add the news ticker to. I'll click pages in the left side menu. Go to the page you want to add it to and click edit. Next, click the plus icon to add it. In the search field, type in short code and click it. I'll paste in the short code and click the save button. Next, click the view page icon and it'll bring up the view of the page you'll see the news ticker has been added to your WordPress site. That is how to add news ticker in WordPress. Give this video a thumbs up and leave us a comment letting us know if the tutorial was helpful or not as the comments help improve our tutorials. Be sure to subscribe to our channel for more WordPress tutorial videos.